Hey everyone, how you doing? Um, I've decided to come down to the riverfront in London today. It's a beautiful sunny day and a lot of people don't believe that it gets sunny in London and I thought I would prove you wrong. It's been a beautiful summer. Um, I'm wearing my flip-flops. As you can see, although they're called thongs um, where I come from. And the river. Looking quite pretty out there in the sunshine. Very nice. We got Putney Bridge up there. That's Putney Bridge. Hopefully you can see it. And I kind of live back up that way a little. So, um, yeah, in the sunshine, I kind of thought I would do, I don't know, something a little bit kind of happy-ish. As you know, based on a true dream, my record is a little bit um, sad at times. It's There it is, in case you haven't seen it. Oops. <laughs> there we go. Um, it, there's a lot of breakup songs on it, and, you know, it's a record that you really listen to in the sunshine, except for maybe track two off A True Dream, uh, which is called Rock and Roll Soho and the Coffee. Um, Rock and Roll Soho and the Coffee was written by me, about me. It talks about city boys. Um, and the chorus goes, come on you city boys, running the world, we're living the rock and roll life. And I suppose my life's had two sides to it. I used to work in finance, doing a lot of finance work in London and in Sydney. and. Um, at the same time, I had all this music stuff going and I kind of figured that my life was a bit too much about money and not enough about doing what I love and I think it's really important to get that balance. So, um, yeah, the chorus kind of talks about me being that city boy and you know, then me versus, versus me being the kind of guy who likes to be a little bit rock and roll sometimes. So, yeah, I hope you like the song. It's got, um, it's called Rock and Roll Soho and the Coffee because it's set in London and it starts with me actually making my way through London in the morning through the busy city and then, um, yeah, picking up my guitar, doing a bit of busking and then, you know, I grab this coffee in the morning, the takeaway coffee, even though I've got nowhere to go. Um, and then it talks about um, the stars can have their bucks because it's not about the money. And that's a bit of a play on the whole Starbucks thing there, and it's it's kind of corporate versus cruisy and artistic and you know independent, I suppose. I'll put it up on MySpace or somewhere so you can hear it. And um, I hope you like my video blog this week. And um, I'll give you another quick look at how beautiful River. Can you see that? Yeah, cool. So that's Putney Bridge. That's towards central London, which is uh, about half an hour on my bike from here. And up there, we've got Hammersmith, and you might be able to see right in the distance um, Wembley Stadium with its big arch, but it might not come out. It's fairly in the distance there. And the dog going swimming. It's really, really hot here today, and it's beautiful. I've got a show coming on the 31st of July. It's about a month from now. It's going to be a full band show. It's at a cool venue called Monto 229 uh, in central London. And I'd love you to come along, um, particularly if you are in London. If you're not from London, you're from some other part of the world, I don't mind if you're not there. Thanks for tuning in. And I hope it's sunny where you are. And if it's not, well, kiss my ass. <laughs> See ya.